Hundreds of thousands of people will flock to San Diego for yet another week of big events. ABC 10 News reporter Ryan Hill spoke with visitors gearing up for Comic-Con about their concerns over security following the tragic mall shooting in Indiana. It seems like everywhere you look in downtown San Diego. And I'll see you there. It's evident. After a two year hiatus, Comic Con is back. And per usual, it's bringing people from all over, like James Woodruff from Cleveland. I've talked to people the last few weeks when I told them I was coming here, and they're like, Aren't you worried about this stuff? And I'm like, More than you know, existentially terrified. That worry sparks from yet another mass shooting over the last few weeks, this time happening at an Indiana mall over the weekend. I think you always have to uh, uh, prepare for the worst and hope for the best. David Glanzer is a spokesperson for Comic-Con. While unable to dive into specifics, he says security is always top of mind at the event. Organizers spend a lot of time working with law enforcement at local and nationwide levels. We're very conscientious of that, and we have a lot of, you'll see a lot of uniformed, uh, security and a lot of security that you won't see. Some restaurants say they're also expecting to see more security in the gas lamp quarter this week. We had a uh, meeting with a gas lamp with the chief of police. There's going to be lots of police officers throughout the gas lamp. Gas lamp has its own security. They're maximizing security as well. There's a balancing act when it comes to easing the mise of Comic-Con attendees and not trying to worry those who have issues about attending. I think it's uh, similar to COVID. You know, one of the things that we've told people is if, if you don't want to attend the event because you don't feel safe, then don't. There's no shame in that. There's no animosity. You know, we all have to take our own precautions and and do what we personally feel is best. Even though there's a cause for concern for some, Woodruff says he hopes there'll be nothing but fun at this year's Comic-Con. I can't let this stuff keep me from enjoying what I like to do. I mean, this stuff's horrible and somebody, something could happen. I'm hoping really we don't have any problems, but I'm not gonna let it stop me from going. Ryan Hill, ABC 10 News.